Hey guys, welcome to another small video and today I'm bringing you an update to my most popular video apparently in the channel. So you guys don't know, the most popular video I have is a video I made of a maxed out food hyper account, which is my food hyper that I personally use. Uh, of course, I've been adding it to friends uh, as when I don't, I'm not spinning things up since I don't need that much food. But the only difference that that account wasn't truly maxed, it was missing uh, academy research and then gear and nightmare, I mean not nightmares, so familiars. But right now I'm going to show you how a truly almost, uh, I say truly because the only thing that is missing is it's, um, what, it's gear, right? So I want to show you in a special way how a maxed food hyper will look. So this is what a maxed food hyper is, right? This is 16 farms on level 25. These are producing 5.2 million food at this very moment. Because this is just base. This is only food production, right? All farms. The only thing is that I'm not able to take the numbers out. But we also have max food uh, research now. So before, this was only at level 9. So 58%. So we got a total of 22% more. Plus, we had the familiar one. Also at level 9. Because it was an academy level 25. It was academy level 24. So that's 20, uh, what is it? Uh, 13 percent more, All right? That's how much more percentage we got from the other video on base. Next, we still cannot uh, take out the familiars, so we have the one of the food hyper familiars maxed out here, and the other food hyper familiar will be right here also. So we have all those maxed out, which will give the base of not that of this the five point almost 5.3 million food per hour that it, that this account produces. Now, of course, this is not max. This is way less than what we saw on my previous video about a year ago. But that's because I want to show you guys step by step. Another thing I added here is the food boost, right? 25%. That's how we got to that number. Now, food boosts, in case you don't know, they're super easy to come by. They're super cheap as well. You can get the seven day one for about 13,000 or 20 some thousand guild coins. Easy. I, I believe that's the pricing for it, right? Resources, uh, seven day, 20, less than 20,000. So easy, cheap. You can always have that running every at all times. Next, I'm going to be adding gear. Now for gear, there's no main hand or off hand that, get, that produce food. We only have accessories. The best one at, legend, at legendary gold would be the flutes. But these other ones are cheaper to get to mythic and at mythic level they get more uh, they give more resources uh, more food production boost than the golden one alone. But I'm currently not able to get my third one to mythic due to uh, missing material to upgrade. That's the only thing I'm missing for accessories. Boots we have the griffin boots. Now I'm this is kind of not lucky at all when hunting, so it's uh, it's gonna take a while to get those scores for this for the boots. And then right here we have the, uh, the chest piece expensive to get to uh, mythic due to the amount of ambers it requires. And then we already have the mythic headpiece, right? The only thing, the only way that we could change this up is by getting a champion piece, but we're not gonna get there, right? The free to play uh, wood hyper. So with the gear equipped, it goes from 5.3 million to 7.1 million. This is a huge boost. This is a 2 million, almost 50% almost 50 percent uh increase in just production next we're missing talents now uh, yes i removed all my talents just for this so oh i don't have an innate one never noticed i never made one for this account but we'll just do it manually as you can see like i usually never change my talents so i'm just going to be doing the food production i'll be fixing it up after the video don't worry so there, that's food production three, food production two, and food production one maxed out. Now, where does that get us? Because that those are huge boosts. That will get us to our maxed out eleven point two, almost eleven point two five million food production per hour. Now, how much is that production in days? Because that's very important, right? How much can you produce in a day? So one point two four uh, two four three. Whoops, yeah, I'll just do that uh, times 24. So, in, in a day, you can produce up to 266 six, almost 270 million food per day. But that's a lie, that's not how much more you can how much how much food you can actually make per day. 
the reason I say this is because in Lords Mobile, when you come to food production, your days are the day pr daily production is not twenty four hour daily production. Your daily production is a twenty eight hour daily production. What do I mean by twenty eight hour daily production? That's quite simple. Let me do this times twenty eight. So at twenty eight hour pro daily production, what I mean is using here. You have gathering rounds. Familiar max out is something you should always have and focus that so you ha you're making a hyper. So it gives you an extra four hours every 24 hours. So your days for production is 28 hours worth of production. Making this account producing 314 million food per day. Granted, I do need to be on uh, emptying out the account on a very hourly basis. Almost hourly, we're looking. So this fills up in about six hours. So I want to swap, uh, empty this account out four times a day in order to be able. So I go to sleep. Empty it out before going to sleep. When I wake up, empty it out. It, since I will lose about two hours there from sleep. But p potentially the account can make up to 3.15 million. In case you're wondering, this is the number. It's 3.14 with 900. So, so that's 314, 315 million food production that you can get on a daily basis. Of course, there's a lot of potential. They can still be fit. We can get more Griffin jewels because I'm mean, not Griffin jewels. Uh, no Seros jewels because No Seros jewels give you the fruit production rate, which actually I can equip a blue one right now. I did not notice that. So equip blue, and they there we go. Now with a blue jewel, the production went up. How much did it go by? Uh, I'll just check this out. One eleven point two eight four times twenty eight. So we went up 1 million more food production per day. So now it's making 3.16 million a day. So 316 million food a day. So yeah, that's an updated view on the food production for the food hyper. This is a max food hyper. Is it worth it for you to get it maxed out? That would be up to you to decide. Uh, by max, I mean Academy 25. Since at Academy 24, uh, we were making what 2.9... Uh, 10.9 times 20 we're making about 305 million per day so of course at a lower rate with 2.9 something you can look it up on, on the previous video i'll leave a link on i'll be leaving it here on the end of the of the video but that's pretty much it oh right on time so i'll catch you guys on next one peace